Hey guys, it's Andy here. Just wanted to show you a video of something I've been working on lately. Um, I've had a long-standing obsession with the uh, Hammond B3 organ, the sound, the look, the feel, everything about it. Um, but being as to I have no place to store a B3 organ and or play a monstrous B3 organ, uh, I've been looking at alternatives. One of the alternatives I found recently, which I just purchased, is this Roland uh, VK8 um, tone wheel clone, which sounds pretty incredible. The action of the waterfall keys is really remarkable, and um, the Leslie uh, effect is pretty spot on. Um, the second thing, which is uh, the primary content of this video, is the Hammond uh, B4 uh, organ clone. And basically, uh, it's a Native Instruments answer to the B3 uh, clone, uh, or I'm sorry, B3 tone wheel organ. Um, so my only problem with that was there was really no way to control all of it unless you bought the controller, which was kind of ridiculous in price. Um, this is the original B4 instrument, uh, and they've gone through B4 too at this point, uh, which has a lot more functionality and a lot more different um, uh, organs to it. Uh, but uh, the one solution that kind of came to me was possibly using uh, the new uh, Korg microcontrol. Uh, and I didn't figure out uh, what that was till just recently uh, as far as how to use it. Um, and basically all you need to do is assign the sliders um, in the chord control editor to the draw bars in the Hammond organ. And you can see I am moving them with the sliders here and they are moving on the instrument. Um, I'm going to play a little bit, uh, hold some chords and do some moves so you can kind of see and hear me playing uh, and hear what it can do. I've also assigned some of the buttons to do other things uh, like vibrato, uh, the pan knobs are vibrato control, uh, percussion and, uh, dis I'm sorry, not distortion, but drive are also assigned and I assigned the uh, Leslie to a, um, a toggle switch here over here which can also be operated by the keyboard's modulation wheel. But I'll turn it off for now so you can kind of see what happens when I do do that. So uh, here it goes, a little bit of Hammond organ-esque music. So I'll go ahead and hold this chord and pull some of the draw bars down. You can hopefully hear that and I can mess with the vibrato. And then go ahead and turn the Leslie on. Turn the Leslie back off. Turn the vibrato off. Give me down to more like a the bottom three bars, like a Jimmy Smith tone. As you can see here, I'll even switch over to the uh, control view so you can kind of see some of the organ. The organ stops being pulled out and pushed in a little bit better. Um, and then you can also see some of the, the knobs there turning when I turn the knobs down here. Um, so yeah, this is the best solution I've been able to come up with this far uh, regarding controlling uh, Hammond organ-esque sounds on a computer. Uh, native instruments. Uh, if you're looking for the Hammond organ sound, I think the B4 by far is one of the best sounding uh, uh, virtual instruments for that particular instrument. Uh, and this is an excellent way to control it. Uh, the board is only about, I think, $60, but in order to have draw bars, it's a great, great, great way to do it. Uh, so I hope you enjoyed this. I um, hope you got some something out of it. Uh, if you have any questions, go ahead and shoot me some uh, messages on YouTube. Thanks.